Purdy Bob's tractor repair. Okay, we got one in. I wanted to just go over a few things on how I did it or what the details are to it. First thing, of course, is you can notice right here the fractured rod I was talking about. When you look at it now, you can barely see that line right there. Now, I are, these do not come marked brand new from the factory, obviously, so I marked them. This is obviously number one. So when you torque these down, the first torque is to 103 foot-pounds on these bolts. You always torque down the one closest to the piston first, which would be this one right here. I call it the short side of the rod. That's always torqued first. I don't go, I don't know what anybody else does, but I don't go to 103 foot-pounds right away. I start out at 50, and I go in 20-pound increments, and work my way up to where I want to end up at. So you're just working your way up as you're doing it, checking it each, you know, periodically. But as you can see, I already, I know it's already there. It has side to side movement. So you know you're not bound up, you're not cocked in there. And then when you come over here, I automatically, after the piston, I got it down, I automatically locked it down with these bolts. Because if you move it, and this sleeve comes up, you have a great possibility of rolling the O-ring. If you roll an O-ring, you don't know it, you're going to have problems. And that means you're tearing it back down again. So that's a basic way of installing the pistons and sleeves in this with the rods. I'm going to go ahead. Oh, there is a final torque on this of 90 degrees, plus 90. After you go to 103, it's plus 90. I'm not going to do that right now because I'd like to flip the motor all the way over and then do them all as one thing. I'm just gonna torque them to 103. That will hold everything for right now until I get them all in and then I can do it all at once because it's just a lot more cranking to do that. Now, I'm not gonna go one, two, three, four, five, six. I'm not gonna do that. Number one was down, number six is down, down there. I'm gonna put number six in. Then that way you only gotta turn the motor. You can turn it a quarter of a turn again, then we'll do two and five, and then we'll do three and four. It's just how I do it. 